What's next? Well, I have a movie that I'm starting uh, in the fall. In the fall, you say, Rosie? Eh? Oh, okay. Yeah, while well, answering an audience question, at Steel City's Comic Con on April 13th, it might just slip Rosie's mind that she had another project coming earlier than fall, one that she started on May 1st. Rosie Instagrammed the front cover of the, and just like that, season three, episode one script, along with her place card at her seat for the table read through. Yep, Rosie is going to be on and just like that. Returning cast members Sarah Jessica Parker, Cynthia Nixon, and Sarita Chowdhury also posted similar shots, but Rosie's debut on the Sex and the City sequel series is getting a little bit more attention. Yeah. Rosie captioned her post, here comes Mary, and Rosie showed off Mary's, I don't think it's long enough to say they're flowing locks, but they're certainly longer flowing locks than Rosie normally has, right? This Saturday, she can be seen on the small screen in HBO's new series, Sex and the City. Please welcome back the always delightful Sarah Jessica Parker. Yeah, back in June 1998, Sarah Jessica Parker was on the Rosie O'Donnell show just days before audiences saw Sarah debut as Carrie Bradshaw in the original series. It's quite compelling. Yeah, Subject I hear matter. it's really it's very great. provocative. Sarah Jessica didn't lie. Now, it would be a lie if Rosie and Sarah Jessica said now that they hadn't worked together before and just like that, because... No, this wasn't just a talk show appearance in 1998. This was working together, singing together. Where there is some nudity. Oh, goodness. But it don't include me. That's good. And yeah, 26 years later, they were at the table read for season three of the revived series. Now, I don't know if they have any scenes together, but they do, and they aren't saying. Yeah, Rosie's Instagram didn't give any further details on Mary or how many episodes Mary will appear in. Now, Rosie's star power certainly helps fill the void left by two departing cast members from season two. This is a huge get for the show and seems like a perfect fit for Rosie. I might have to watch this show now. But yeah, what do you think of Rosie joining the show? And uh, what about the idea of um, Rosie and Sarah Jessica Parker, you know, recording a theme song for season three? You like? Sex and the city. 